think what Hamas did was justified? <clears throat> Do you think certain groups of people have more privilege? Yes. I know I get privileged until people find out my name and then they act a little bit different. Proof of imperialism alive and well. It's a systemic thing everywhere we go. She's like an order to everything. I mean, white supremacy is what built America. Our society is built to keep certain people down. There's a lot of sympathy for Jewish people just because of what they've been through in the Holocaust and there's a lot of stigma around Arab people because of like 9-11. In certain in certain contexts I, I would say so but I wouldn't give it a blanket statement you know. What are your feelings on the situation happening in Gaza? I think it's a mess. I don't think it's right man. It's heartbreaking. It's absolutely egregious. It's proof that imperialism is alive and well. American imperialism. Proof that indigenous people are still in harm's way. Can't deny it. Whose side are you on? Palestine. 100% pro-Palestine. Palestine side. Free Palestine. I'm Gaza side. Why are you for Gaza? Because it's genocide. Do you think what Hamas did was justified? <laughs> I think they deserve to retaliate. I do believe they have a right to defend themselves, yeah. Do you think the Revolutionary War was justified? What about October 8th? What about October 9th? Lots of the things they claimed happened on that day didn't actually happen. Are there hostages in Gaza? If there are any, they're definitely not being treated the way that Palestinian hostages are being treated. I'm gonna show you this quick video. <laughs> All their fucking families probably been killed too. Certainly an interesting video. Got no comment on that. Murder is wrong. I, I just want peace in that region. Say for instance, I murdered 10 people. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? You were my dad and I called you and told you. I'd be upset and disappointed that my son murdered 10 people because I would have thought, you know, that I raised him not to murder 10 people. Would you consider Hamas for the fighters? Ooh, that's a big one. Yeah, essentially, yes. Their parents have been killed by Israel. All they know is war. I don't think that's a question for me to answer. See, that's, that, that's where it gets a little in, in that gray area. Say for instance, came to the United States, kidnapped 1,400 people. What do you think we would do? I mean, you're putting it in that perspective now, I'm like, this is awful. Does Israel have the right to exist? I would say no, they don't. No. <laughs> no. I don't think, you know, that should be a state or whatever, you know. Not in Palestine. Where is this going to get posted to? Do you believe that Jewish people are white people? Yes, I do. I don't really know. Yes and no. What about Palestinians? No. There's no white in me. If I had a board and I put Jewish people and Muslims on a board, mm -hmm. who do you think would be more oppressed? Muslims. The Jewish people are the ones doing the oppression. Like, what does that mean again? <laughs> the Israelis. Anything you want to say to America? I hope y'all wake up. There is nothing Palestine or Hamas could have possibly done to justify Israel's response. How is that even a question? Obviously. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. Yeah.